I, I, I can, you see, I, I, I don't know. Something's happening. Uh, anyway, um, I don't know. Um, um, what I what I had. We're going to war. We're, we're sending them over to Israel. Israel, Israel. When they started the Iraq war, it was exactly like that, but that happened about 5 o'clock at night. I was out here working and all of a sudden I heard the planes going like that. I went out to see if they were coming in, but they were going out. And I thought, now this is odd. So next morning, they said that they'd ship this squadron over to Iraq. They flew the planes over to Iraq. So, as many planes that went just now, something is happening. They're either sending them someplace, or, or they've been someplace, and they're coming here to refuel to go someplace else. Um, anyway, um, Uh, been watching um, I've been wa watching a um, I have been watching a uh, history of computers oh yeah and um so I was just watching it and and getting my mind set set and and I thought it out. Now so it, it, it took me a long time to it took me a long time. To remember, to remember, um, so um, I started out in. Uh, 1994. You, you started out in 80. When did you start out? Yeah. Well, actually, I started out way back when I was at the nuclear plant. I knew that they were going to change over their instrumentation to computerize it. Oh. I knew that they were going to computerize reactors. So I attempted to teach my help. I teach them how a computer works. We had the information of how it worked was out. Oh, uh, here, here. Wait, 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 wait. Here, write my my book. What? My book. Write it in my book.
Okay. Ninth today, I think. Is it? Yeah. Ever change the belt? Or did once or go so darn fast? Today is the night. Well, I, I think I had I had mission explain this to you sometime way back when. But what I did back let's see you now that would have been that would have been about The year nineteen sixty eight, approximately. That I saw in a magazine a little thing about this this wide and this high. And it had levers on the side. And this thing looked like this. Let's see, now that went all the way through. And all the way through. Yes. No, that wasn't it. That wasn't it. Have a one and a zero. Okay. If they would pull this thing this way, it would it would print. It would produce someplace in in the the mechanism. It would produce a one. If they pulled this lever this way, it would produce a zero. And as they would pull the different ones, it would bring up a letter down here. And uh, I don't remember what the code was now. But let's just say that they pull it that way, they got a one, and they push it that way, they got a zero. That would produce an A down here. Then they would go down here, and they would push it that way, and it would produce a zero. Then they would they would pull it this way, and it produce a 1, and let's say that would produce a B down here. It 
You know, you kind of get the idea. Right. No electric whatsoever. No nothing. No electric. All mechanical. But the idea of how it works is the same because this is producing a one and a zero. That's exactly what your computer is doing, producing one and zeros. So um, this thing was uh, was uh, this was not was. Uh, not uh, this thing was uh, mechanical. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, what the theory? But but, but uh, no electricity. Not whatsoever. But it. But it, it, the theory is that. It's the same theory as how that works. Mm. What, what, what did you, you said you, you, did you, Uh, 1968, you, did you get, get it? Did you get? Oh yeah, I ordered, I ordered that. Oh really? Yeah, through Argonne. What? Through Argonne, where I worked. Oh. I ordered it through, because it was in the magazine that I got, or I used to get a lot of nuclear magazines, and, and that was that thing was in there. So I thought that would be good for me to get it to teach my help how a computer would work when we get, when they were developed. Uh -huh. And when, when was that? 1968. No, when when was that? The, that. You have a computer. At Argonne, there was a room about four times this size of this ship. It was full of tubes and resistors and condensers and things, and it was a computer. Oh. The only thing that could do was play checkers. What? It could only play checkers. It, it, it knew how to move something. It had a brain, or, or when I say it had a brain, it was programmed yeah. to play checkers. So if you would move something over here, that thing would think to move it over here and block that. It knew enough to do that. Yeah. But it, it did it couldn't do anything else at that. They played around, experimented with it. Then, you you remember when the uh, the punch card came out? Would, they would punch holes in a, in a card. Yeah. That was the next episode in the computer stage.
So, uh, what, so when did you, what, why did it happen that you, why, why, why you, what happened, what happened, you, you, the, oh, the government just uh, stopped. Nixon pulled the research money. Oh, and you, when, so, when, 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 when was it? Uh, in 1970, 1973. And then you went to, uh, Florida, and you got into the electric cars. And when you into computers then? That's when I came back here. That's when I, our daughter and son was living here. In 1973, our daughter and son came out here to live in Arizona, and we went to Florida. Uh huh. So we would come out to visit them. So then, when we lost the, the contract to build electric postal trucks, the electric car company dissolved. I mean, it was gone. It closed up. When was that? Uh, about 1982. Okay. My wife was working, and I went on unemployment, but nobody could get... There was no such a thing as a uh, research and development director for electric car. That was my title. I see. That's what they, when you're on unemployment, they're supposed to get you a job that's the same as that or equal. I see. When you go to Florida, there's no such a thing as an equal job. There's no and, big. And why would you, why would you, uh, why would the, uh, What was your title? Uh, uh, the, the working at the plant. Director of Research and Development. Oh, Director of Research and Development. 